hello, I really adore when StreamYard gives to me information, you are alive. Thank you so much. Today with me, a really curious book. If you like fantasy, if you like history, if you like, like politician stuff and intrigue and psychology, everything you will find in this brilliant book, Titus Groan by Melvin Pick. If you want to boost your curiosity, if you just adore beautiful pictures inside your mind, everything you will find in this beautiful, mysterious story. And I think it's really unusual because when you think about fantasy, Usually you think about dragons, about elves, about, I don't know, princess, prince, etc., monsters. But inside the story, you will find only dark castle, labyrinth. Not only labyrinth like inside this castle. It's more like a labyrinth human emotions. It's like a labyrinth human relationships and labyrinth different protagonists because in the story you haven't like only one main protagonist you have different people in this interesting world because it's not exactly like our world but if you try to think a little deeper you will recognize it's so similar to so many situations in your life. And if you want to try something completely new, if you are a big fan of fantasy, but you think, no, no more stories about dragons, about witches, wizards, and something like that, Marvin Pick, it will be probably a good choice for you. Okay, and what next? Next, every week, I want to share with you book, but not something what you just have possibility to find in your private library, but something like a book when you try to read these books with curiosity. You don't expect something like that. And maybe... It's something when you first time will think, yeah, it was really unexpected and brilliant story. Or after a few pages, you just will start to say, oh my God, it's the worst book ever. Who knew? We never know. And all the time, it's a good idea to just check it. You know, in English, you have something like tribe. I don't know, it's a good uh, pronunciation, like tribe. In Polish, it's trip. But in English, it's meaning try before you buy. And it's a really good idea when we have access to so many brilliant books, but not necessarily with brilliant stories inside. And I adore this possibility when i able to read a short part, sometimes whole chapter from book what I want to buy in the future because in the moment I able to recognize mindset, style and how a writer try to create this story. It's really impossible. How many times you just try to read something but you not really understand what about they say the story? Yeah, please. Maybe it's a good idea to check it. But of course, we need to remember about another side. All the time, try to push a little your comfort zone. And it's same rules if we think about books. Don't try only read something really easy and nice for you. Maybe sometimes it's a good occasion to read something beautiful, but you need to understand deeper this topic 
or you need to check it something, like definition, like what is meaning. It's all the time good possibility to know a little more about something with books, because it's really safe way to know something. I know we still have like so many countries when you haven't possibility to read everything what you want, but every time with the internet, we have more possibilities to find access to almost everything. But sometimes it's like possibility to find like access to every bullshit. Yeah, but it's next practice, next lessons to us. We have right now so many different sources. You have access almost to everything, but sometimes it's not like useful information. Sometimes it's only like oh, right now we are call, uh, call, uh, calling this uh, fake news or something like that. But in the past, we have something like that. Gossips. It's like the fake news too. You never know. This is like gossips because it's like a little true inside this or maybe it's completely like imagination only. These people who use gossips as like a weapons, as like something to build connection or something like that. Okay, right now it's like six minutes. Thank you so much. I still try to improve my English skills. And right now, uh, I've found that free, wonderful, wonderful what? Wonderful teachers. Yeah, because, you know, usually we have these bad habits. And my first idea in my mind was free persons. But, you know, never persons, people, people. And uh, right now, I hope I have next journey, next occasion to meet interesting people and improve my English skills. And, you know, after one month, maybe I can talk to you one hour. Who knows? <laughs> Thank you so much. Take care and stay safe. And of course, if you have this possibility, try to read a little Titus Grand by Marvin Pick. Thank you so much.